Hey, buddy. Uh, we'll see how it is. I don't think it's anything that's going to be too, too serious. Couldn't finish the game. Um, so we'll see where things are tomorrow. Yeah, it's different. Yeah, something different here. Well, we, you know, I think that, that we when we did, uh, we didn't finish. There were some mistakes. Um, you know, would have liked to have the the early shot. You know, and then we have a penalty that, you know, on a conversion. You know, we we knew when we had practiced about, you know, move and hop around on third down, and uh, you know, little just disappointing that that we aren't set, and then being able to to move one of our better players around to. To help them get a, you know, help us uh, get a conversion. So, you know, it's a penalty there. We're not set. You know, then can't, you know, we have the, the touchdown, the fumble return. Can't protect the quarterback, and then, um, you know, just not scoring down there inside the red zone. So there, there were some, you know, obviously some things that that weren't, you know, very good. There'll probably be some some better plays um, once we have a chance to look at it. Um, you know, but then it's just not complimentary enough. You know, the penalty, you know, we get a stop and then a penalty, you know, give them the ball back. So it's hard to play um, any game when, when, you're, when you're not complimenting each other and there's just mistakes. You talk about uh, the little things that get to be and the dumb shit that puts teams at this stage of the season, you're disappointed. You're still getting stuff like 12 men on the field, running into the kicker. Yeah, always disappointed. You know, I mean, we've we've become our own version of Friday tape, and uh, you know, we guys down or you know things are going and changing in a hurry. Um, you know, we have to all be tuned in, and um, some of those things that that you can overcome, and we're not uh, we're not where we need to be to to be able to overcome those things. And you know, I know Caleb, um, you know, was really you know trying to take that role of special teams and. You know, he had driven the, the wing into the, the punter last week, and that's legal. Uh, but if you, you know, if you're obviously not driving the wing back into the punter, you, you can't run into him. And, you know, just like Caleb had some really cool snaps last week, some good snaps on kickoff coverage, talked about his violence. and But then you, know, you just have to know where you're, you're now you're on a different unit. And that, you know, I guess trying to finish can't override the decision making. You know, it's a young player that, you know, again, we've been searching for for outside linebackers to help us in the special teams game. And Caleb's starting to do that. Um, you know, just one of those penalties that you, know, you have to be, you know, be able to avoid. How many mistakes did you generally show them in the Friday Well, there's good, there's bad. I mean, there's all types of things, you know. And those are, those are the ones that we've uh, seen and those are the ones that, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're doing ourselves. Well, I mean, I think it's pretty limiting, and it has it. You know, there not every play is like that, but you know, we'll have to find uh, you know ways to protect the quarterback, and and whether we're we're chipping and uh, you know leaving guys in, it's you know it's hard when you when you leave a lot of guys in against zone coverage. You know, there's a lot of guys covering you know just a couple. So you know, I think that there's always a balance, and and we've talked about some of the things that we need to be able to do. You know, you can run the football and you can then, you know, run some some play passes that have, you know, different blocking schemes, different angles. You know, that's where you can kind of leave guys in because, you know, you get some sell from the underneath coverage and then you're able to to hit some things behind it or, or take a shot. So, you know, you have to be able to do some of those things to, to keep players in. And third down, you know, probably you know, got a chip once in a while, but... Also, got to try to get some guys out to, to help the quarterback. They sacked you 13 times during the course of the two games over three weeks. Is, is that super limiting in terms of what you're able to do on offense overall? Yeah, I mean, we, we have to be able to protect our quarterback. I, I mean, the, the, the numbers are the numbers, you know. So, you got to be able to protect the quarterback if you want to be able to throw the football in this league. I'm punching this is maybe just to spark a play like Burt made the early, just bring us some energy early. I, I don't know. I don't. We, we didn't make the play, so I don't know what the what the reaction would have been. I think that's a 
it's a hypothetical question, but you have to, you know, go out there and be able to, to make some of those plays. You know, make some guys miss and break some tackles, um, complete some contested catches. Same thing on, on defense. You know, we have to be able to knock the ball out of somebody's hand. We're going to be able to hit it off the quarterback, tip it up in the air. Um, you know, it's pro football. I know you're frustrated that anytime you lose, but to be winless so far in the division, it's pretty difficult, I imagine. Yeah. What do you think could have been done differently on that seven-play sequence and try to plan a little bit to try and score the end goal? You know, I just being able to run it in, being able to, you know, protect the quarterback and, you know, just didn't happen. You know, we were, we were, uh, give them credit, but, uh, you know, weren't able to, uh, to score. It's, it's a huge play. How can they help them up when you guys just go so bad? Mm, I, I'm, I'm not sure. I, I really am not, you know, I'm not, you know, don't have any answers for, um, knee injuries on, um, on gunner play. I know that that's something that the league has, has looked at. That's a, it's a long play with guys tugging on you. So, um, that was, that was one of the injuries that occurred today. We'll, you know, we'll go by case by case basis, um, later on, you know, just, uh, you know, quarterback, when the quarterback gets hit, you know, nothing good's going to happen from it. Uh, he was probably questionable. He was less than 100%. Mark, by Will got himself in position to play. I guess that kind of got kind of forced. Yeah, yeah. I mean, everybody's trying, I think, to, to get themselves in a position to play. You know, Kayvon, SMB, Will, and, you know, Will wants to play for us. He does. And, uh, you know, we, we got to do a better job and, you know, protect whoever's back there throwing the football and get open quicker and, you know, Execute our offense, you know, be able to, to to run and marry some things up off that and then keep it in third and manageable. We'll do everybody else. I guess dealing with another one of these. Uh, how tough is it for me to let him down? I mean, I don't, it's the same thing. I don't know. Same, we talk the same, say the same thing. We just didn't play well enough today for, to win. You feel like you make it, you know, if you make a play here or there, Maybe it creates a spark, and maybe things are different. And how much you lack in that play? Yeah, I mean, never big plays created, touchdowns. You know, it gets momentum going for us. We weren't able to do that today. Um, I think they did a great job controlling the game. Do you feel limited in what you can do based on what's coming on the front right now? No, just ain't play well enough. Brian said he feels like John Wick at the end. Of how hard is it to watch the quarterbacks get beat up to the degree that? Knocked out of the games and they're feeling like that. Yeah, I'm not going to keep my teammates down. Um, we all didn't play well enough as a group. Um, you know, it's tough to see the quarterback get hit, but we always got to be better collectively um, to be able to uh, make plays and not have sacks. Are you surprised that after all those weeks of saying that you have to be better collectively, that hasn't happened? Say it again? Are you surprised that after all these weeks of saying that you guys need to be better collectively, you're still saying it? I just said earlier, we just the same old thing. We say the same old thing. It's all I can. It's all I can say. Um, you know, just has been the year we wanted it to be. Got one more game. Try to finish strong with that one. How do, how do you approach that last that last game, Derek? Given the results, that they got today? go back to work. Um, uh, bring some energy. Um, just just work hard throughout the week. Bring intensity. Everybody trying to make each other better. And do whatever we can to try to go win. How much would it mean to get that one and not go winless in the division? I mean, it'll definitely put a smile on everybody's faces. I feel mine. Uh, to go out with a win, um, it was going to be tough. Another division opponent, they're a great team. Um, but got to figure it out somehow. I know you want to win. DeAndre goes over 1,000 yards. You go over 1,000 a day. Do you, is that a little bit of a payoff for? the work you put in and still be able to do that at this stage of your career? Um, I don't really, I mean, stats are stats. Um, you know, uh, us, you know, not playing as well as we need to, to be able to, to win games is, you know, more important. Um, if you do what you're supposed to do, then 
the other stats and everything else to take care of itself. But um, collectively, um, that's the most, you know, it's a point thing for us is not being able to put it all together on all three phases. Too much, I guess. Uh, Quarterback getting hurt. Next guy coming in, I guess. Quarterback getting sacked. I mean, how much the frustration level like like as a team? Yeah, it's hard. You, know, you guys go down, and um, you know, we just got to do a better job of of doing our job all the way around. You know, if it's blocking, then blocking. If it's Catching, catching, throwing, throwing, or whatever the case may be, we just got to do a better job of doing our jobs. Some occasions there where you've got chance? Yeah, definitely. Did you see Will or what was he telling? Yeah, I talked to Will. You know, he gave me a brief thing. I guess we'll find out more in the next couple of days. But, uh, yeah, feel for him. Obviously, he's battling. Um, kind of a freak thing just the way it happened. But I guess we'll see what, what uh, happened. How much the team just kind of missing a spark early in games to maybe change the momentum or, or just get some energy going? Yeah, you just got to do a better job of executing. You know, you can't um, go out and go three and out and expect the energy to be, uh, you know, really high, you know. Um, find a way to, to execute early in games and, and uh, score some points. Oh man, it's always good being in Houston. Uh, love the fans, love the city. Uh, you still got a lot of love for for these good folks here. It means a lot to me. Uh, no matter what the record says, you got to have a little pride and, and take uh, accountability in what you can do and what you can control. And I feel like, uh, you know, that's 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 my mindset. I don't know, man. It's football, they get paid too. Does it feel limiting at a certain point when there's so much pressure and it's harder to have plays develop downfield? Um, you know, that's that's a question that's above my pay grade. The only thing I can do is go control what I can when the ball is thrown to me. What's frustrating? It's always frustrating to lose for me. You know, I'm, I'm a competitor. Uh, I hate losing. I hate losing. And, Checkers, you know, whatever it is. So, uh, you know, it's always frustrating to lose. How do you keep it from lingering? How do you keep it from lingering the loss? Uh, just having faith in, you know, just uh, knowing life is, uh, life is, life is short, man. And how big has your faith been in something like that? Uh, my, my faith has been big since I came out the wound in Section A projects.